They say that doing the same thing over and over and expecting different results makes you insane. Well, I believe them. <laughs> what is going on guys? Today, I, my, st all right, so here's the deal. I got more, I had to go get more um, antibiotics. I apologize if you're looking at this and going, wow, that's nasty, because it looks gross. It's basically inside of my eyelid. I had to get more antibiotics and hopefully pray to God because it's been two months that I've had this thing coming in and out. I want to have as much screen recording time as possible. Today, I want to fix some of your guys' beats. I made a tweet out a while ago saying to send me your send me uh, FLPs, and I want to do that. And um, I'll, yeah, that's it. Let's get it. Hopefully, I'm going to try to do as many as I can in a couple hours. And um, if you enjoy this video, drop a like. Pray for me. Hopefully, this time it will be gone in the next like week and then be gone forever. Like I'm doing everything perfectly. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. Go follow me on Instagram where I post pictures of me without styles. Let's get into the video in three, two, one. Also, if you guys don't know, I read most of these comments. Pretty much all of them, by the way. I get a lot of them. And um, and some, some people, not a lot, go, hey, Kyle, bro. You make the same type of beats every single time. These emotional, sad, happy melodies. They're all very emotional and melodic and all this stuff. Make some dark trap shit, blah, 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 which I've done before. I've made the dark trap stuff before. I've done it all. I made this yesterday. Beat number one, we have is a beat called Enhance. It's from Rad Rad Dronzy. He had like a um, 808 plugin that I just replaced with my with my KB Big Daddy 808. Just threw some random 808 in there, and it, it works though. It works. first kind of hear you're just like wow this is like for a producer you're like wow this is kind of harsh like fl keys and like 808 sound kind of harsh from what i'm hearing right now but when i listen back through it like it kind of ha it has a good flow to it like so i feel like you could rap over this it has a good it has a good bounce the structure is like really good if you look through here this is where you rap idea is like is like really good i just want to go through it and uh honestly like the things that this needs right now is like is like a little bit of mixing and like just touch up on the just like mixing and sound selection and, and potentially taking some things the first thing i'm going to do and i'm going to give him if i if i add like melodies from omnisphere obviously he has everything stock if i add melodies from omnisphere my own kicks from my packs i'm going to send him those like the wave of the melody or i'll send him the the kick that he can plug in so he's not going to be, not be able to use this too many kicks in there. Let me listen to the 808. Just gonna change this a little bit. less kicks in here, but just one too many kicks. Maybe not, maybe not. 
up. Kicks sound good. Hi hats, I'm gonna replace with another hi hat. Um, they're very like harsh. I'm also gonna change the clap just to the kingdom. Shorten the rim snare a little bit. Put a little reverb on the pianos. EQ on the pianos as well, just get them sounding nice. Not clashing with the 808 too much. I'm gonna push that 808 back down now. So a little bit of distortion on there. Nice and clean. All right, so I'll put a little EQ on this little citrus. from short George Calibus he said what can I do to this I, I didn't he didn't send me the sounds for the drums but I have everything else pretty much he also didn't let me know what electric sound he used for some reason it didn't it didn't open up even though it's the same thing I think it was called something else so it didn't open up and you know what I don't have enough time to figure it out but I will say this well atmosphere loaded perfectly which is like the main sound that he used um, I will say this, the melodies are super dope. Everything's sounding great. This 808 is clean. Let's hear how the intro sounds amazing. He did a great job on everything. Uh, I'll show you where he kind of slacked. Super fire. Woo! Timing, everything is perfect right here. Damn, hey. I 
like I said, I added in my own drums. He used like different types of perks and stuff like that, but you kind of get the feel of it no matter what. Um, Let's start with the kick. The kick was just, there's too many times, it's, it's hitting way too many times. Your kick should not look like this. Like there's too many, it's just, this looks like a hi-hat pattern or something. Doesn't need these three, take those three out. Like that, I'm gonna repeat that. Here. Um, crash looks fine, everything with that looks fine. It sounds weird because right? I just threw a sound in there. Let me get a better one. Put a little transition whoosh from Flex. Uh, this is one of those beats that kind of has those type of transitions, I feel like. back again see what it sounds like That's what you need to do. Take the 808 out when that when that comes in. Uh, let me try changing the hi hat too. I think it needs. I think we need to take this first little t -t -t out as well. It's just too much. couple um, extra hi-hats in here as well. I just I just want to take that kick out. I think the kick just it just feels I don't know just needs to be less. Electra X sound is just, just the 808 comes in. And then bring it this
All right, this next one is simply called Random as Hell. This is the last one I'm doing today. Um, I just replaced all the sounds with like Omnisphere sounds and stuff like that. Um, just something a little more easy on the ears. The drums are kind of insane. But here's what he ha here's what he sent me. completely just take this limiter off because I looked if you look at the mix everything is being way is everything is way too loud and got crushed down with the limiter which is not what you're supposed to do mix on a low level and then bring it up instead of crushing it down That's a lot. Of, that's something people do a lot. Is they just put too many kicks. If you put too many kicks, it's gonna, it's just gonna throw off the whole rhythm. It's just like it's just bouncing around too much. Like this, too much going on sometimes with too many kicks. I feel like sometimes people just that's the the last two beats has just been too many kicks. Like this at the end. Like only in rare occasions will something like will something like this work at the end. Especially every four bars getting that same duh, 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 duh. That's only something that has like a 16 bar loop or a, or at least an a bar loop that at the end has that duh, duh, Whatever that like kick thing But like every four bars is hearing duh, 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 just too much I like that high, I like that open hat. Um, I'm just gonna turn it down. Turn the hi hats way down. I'm gonna switch it with one of mine too. I'm just gonna have that thing repeat again. So I'm gonna go to this 808 real quickly. Completely like. Actually, let me see if I can shift it down. It's just it's just in the wrong. It's just not in the right. Uh, it's just not in key at all. It's in a completely different key. You're supposed to match up your 808 with the melody. You know what I mean? So, um, so I, that right there sounds better. I'm gonna try to match it up. Where, where am I? All right. I hate it so much. I'm gonna throw on the Big Daddy. Just go with. It. about these melodies it needs more I need I need more in this melody man this I'm gonna play one of these at the same time just loop it and uh, figure this out what's the main melody
That sounds a lot better, so now I'm gonna go through and fix it a little bit. First note's fine. Alrighty then, that's the end of this video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Yeah, let me know if you guys think I should do it again. Go follow me on Instagram and Twitter to stay updated for whenever I do stuff like this because I tweeted it out for you guys and I tweeted, hey, blah, 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 some of your links. Um, yeah, hopefully this eye is gone soon. Uh, big things are being planned. I'm gonna continue. I'm going to continue making videos while working on other things and uh, make sure you subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. Join the Kyle Beats crew. So much exciting stuff in the way. Everybody let's please hope that this thing finally, once and for all, after two months of being on and off, goes away. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching.